Hello everyone and welcome back to the Grim Clicker. Uh, if you'll notice that I'm a little more upgraded now because my weapons and stuff. I figured out how to play the entire game in the course of three recordings. So let's... <laughs> and I'm very upset about that. So I've reached what I think is the final boss three times now. Each time I wasn't recording or there's a... It got corrupted or my computer crashed. So hopefully this time... Ugh, this time... Oh, sh I forgot about this. But we're not gonna make it anyways, because I, I doomed us. So this is the final boss, I didn't realize. So basically he's a dragon of eternity. That's all the lore you got here. And you have to kill him in a certain amount of time. And I figured out the shop. The shop is actually useful. The black wax and candles are useful. What? Yes, I know. Correct. The shards are useful. Everything's useful. Don't waste any of it because this dragon's insanely hard, difficult to kill. I've also figured out the inventory because you can actually craft stuff, upgrade stuff, put gems and stuff. I said stuff too much for that. I wait, am I gonna actually kill him in this first five minutes of this recording? Is this what's gonna happen? Probably not. Because my energy is too wait, can I buy I can buy stuff. Hopefully. Please. Yes. Okay, so you, there's potions, you can buy potions and that's not that. By potions and equipment. That helps you upgrade. And it's extremely useful. Am I really gonna get to kill the boss? I never killed this is the most closest I've gotten to act gotten to actually killing it. I did it! I am the greatest. So what, do we restart the game or what? Blade of mechanic, flask of water, stone of corn flowers, a soul, and oh, the usurpation. This usurpation potion is the greatest. It just lets you blitz through everything in your path. That, I don't know if I want to use it now because it doesn't work on bosses, but I'll use it once. I'll use one to show you. So basically, you clear the entire level instantly. So the original plan for this, I didn't expect to kill the boss so easily. But it happened. He was a big... What is this? Oh. That's useful. Right, we'll, we'll organize it before I'm going to finish what I was saying. So the original plan was to basically use the candles that I, I have here. Complete the ritual. Which would have, this would have set, it would have sent me to the start of the game with a slight bonus because of the voodoo doll I had. Thousand black And with that, I would have been able to get even stronger each time, each iteration, upgrade earlier and earlier, and get more bonuses to buy from the, uh, the black wax shop. Which is just, Oh, this is, these are new. These ghosts are new. I haven't seen this before. I really haven't used the rituals. Let's organize the inventory. Switch you out. Blade, blade of mechanic, base damage 40. Quality. Two, okay. No. Upgrade. Charm. Can we charm this? No. Okay, so we'll charm the two weapons. Disassemble that. 
Just assemble this. I can't destroy that, exactly. Oh, and each of the stones, so I didn't, I should have explained. The stones, or charms as they're called, you can basically upgrade your weapon. To the max. Or, yeah, to the max. And use that to basically kill everything. For those of you who don't know or haven't figured it out yet, this is literally a clicker game. Nothing special about it. Well, that's a, this is actually useful. It makes my stamina so much higher. Oh, I'm so rich. I think I played the game wrong because I, I don't think I'm supposed to be this rich to just be able to upgrade. I'm a millionaire. Souls. One die. This is an alpha game. I don't know if this game will last forever. I've said that before. If it does, I might wait for it to be completely. Re no, it's not an alpha. It's an early access. And I might. W I'll probably wait for it to be fully released. And then start another series in the meantime. Because I've been meaning to do Enderall. Forgotten Stories, if you don't know, Enderall is a Skyrim conversion mod, which basically makes an entire game using the Skyrim engine. And it's really good, I played some of it, but I haven't finished the main quest, and I was thinking of doing like a main quest line, or maybe just side quests, depending on how I'm feeling. So, and I really, I really like it, it's, it's fun. Should never stop the snowstorm. That's the rule. I want to use this here already. But at this point, see we're slowing down now. How slow we are to die. <laughs> Everything dies. So basically, yeah, I get to upgrade. What's this? I don't like how this doesn't tell you. That's a criticism. This doesn't tell you what any of this stuff does until you unlock it. I didn't mean to click that. Damn it. It's gonna take forever to kill this guy. Just 10 more stamina. See now the boss, see now this is where I think, well, where I might actually have to do the ritual anyways. Cause this is just slow and I didn't, I'm waiting for my bonus thing to kick in. It just says full stamina. Three, two, one, now. So it basically clicks for me. And I can't beat in this game. What's happening? What's happening? What's happening? What's happening? There's a mouse going everywhere on my screen. I'm not clicking, I'm not touching it. Why am I going, why is it still going? Oh wait, no, it's the it's the bonus. That's not, I've never noticed that. I don't know if you guys can see it yet, but the, there's like a black mouse. Twice the size clicking all over the, the screen. Absolutely killing everything. Okay, now I got tired. Okay, I'm debating whether or not to to do the ritual which will restart me at the beginning of the game but I can get even more bonuses and better stuff because your, all your weapons go down to the normal they still keep the magical enchantments or charms you whatever they're called you put on them. but oh this is good now yeah. yeah ritual time Mortituri di de sai duan. All of this is Latin. I have no idea what it means. And here we are at the beginning of the game. Yay! Oh. Oh. So the weapons do are beefy. They do do plenty of damage. And I should have switched for the voodoo doll. Damn it! <sighs> so the voodoo doll. Oh yeah, I destroyed it. I'm so stupid. 
as I was saying, the voodoo doll, basically, it gives you a bonus every time you do that. And that would have given me a great bonus of random stuff or experience or whatever. And help me, but now shop, I can buy stuff. Nope, I can't buy according to the shards. Value room, experience. Ah, oh, I just spent everything. This is all very useful. I'm already at level 2 and I haven't been even paying attention. I'm amazing. Blizzard. Rage of Darkness. Blizzards. Not upgraded anything yet. Blizzard. Everything dies super fast now. You can barely- they barely get a chance to get on the screen before they die. This is amazing. Come on, I'll, I'm gonna try to reach it to make it to you guys. Come on, you're getting closer, come on. Nope, it's not happening. Level 4, see, and each time you go, you level up slightly faster and faster. Useful. Candles. That, that was a boss to get candles, right? I think so. So, oh, I just realized the black wax, the amount of, or no, the amount of candles you have, turns into the, this black wax over here in Blizzard. Blizzard should never stop. And that lets you buy. Okay, I, I just thought it was just for the ritual. And they were separate from each other. Faster. Stamina. I'm level four. Usually it would take forever to reach level four again, which is why I don't like the ritual, because it just takes everything takes forever now, but now everything dies super fast. I'm good with stamina. I need to upgrade my weapons. I'll save up for the sword of my sword. It's got sort of excellence of dominance. Excellence? I can't say that. Excellence of dominance. Yeah, sure, why not? I wonder if I'll actually get past the first branches of these to maybe this area, because I've never upgraded from that area before. See how fast everything dies? I need to save up for the sword, I keep forgetting. There we go. And now I'm tired. I still do so much damage though, this is... So much better than before. The other times, the playthroughs you guys didn't get to see, because of technical difficulties, this took forever, this took like an hour and a half to complete all of this again. And I'm just breezing through it. It's amazing. I like how this is a clicker game and also could be an idle game. Because it's just, you don't really have to do anything. It's when you have such high damage stats, you don't have to do anything. You just sit back, relax, and drink too. Ah. 
they all scream. Arr, arr. This is so far breeze. We got the champions. Marvelous are present. That's the first time I see one of those like mana restores. Usually they're for uh, stamina. Upgrade Blizzard because it's very good passive damage for this. Sprint. Let's try Sprint. Okay, it doesn't work on the boss. Anything that coming. Blizzard. And Sprint. You got a little jump of like jumping straight to people makes it faster. Okay, that's useful. I can see how that's useful. Great everything. I'm already level six. This is going great for me. Oh yeah, I forgot. Kind of repeats. Blizzard! Come on, experience. I've never seen the cornflower before, that's me. Well, this is new. Well, like, newer stuff is being dropped in the game. Maybe it's because it got past the dragon. I wonder if the dragon will still be there, because everything's repeated before. But the dragon, I'm pretty sure, is like a unique boss. It's different from everything else, it has its own stage. Does that mean it's complete unique or what? Completely unique or what? Blizzard, I should be upgrading. me all your wealth. I'm just ripping rubies out of these animals. Or monsters. I think these are animals. At least these are the rat. Like, they're marsupials. Let's call it that. Come on, everything just die quickly, please. I have a very busy schedule for replaying this entire thing. I've said this before in the other videos I never got recorded. Or posted. One thing I don't like about this game which is the mechanic of you have to, you have to go back all the way to the end. And that can get kind of tedious after a while. And if you, especially if you don't know what you're doing, like the mechanic itself, you don't know why you need to why you need to. Uh, oh yeah, why you need to. Do the rituals to get the black wax and buy upgrades. And I didn't get that until this right now, this playthrough. So it's like you have to play the entire thing. And I didn't hit the R. I didn't do that. Activate automatically. I did not click that. Maybe I did, but it's working. Everything is dying super quick. Oh, okay. Oh. Oh, is it this? Maybe. I don't know. So I've never seen that before. That was weird. Just hurry up and die. As I was saying, it kind of gets tedious after you play. You have to complete 
keep restarting again and again and again, yeah. It gets monotonous and boring. After, kind of boring after a while. It does feel good to finally kill the dragon. Or finally to get past that one thing that's been holding you back. Which makes sense, but it's also very monotonous and horrible. Can I upgrade anything else? I only... Die. Everything dies. Should I do the... Screw it. I lost patience. Everything dies. What quest? What do you want? Why are you glowing? That was a bat. I could have used that. Blizzard. Come on, Rage of Darkness. Come on, Rage of Darkness. Come on. That's number four. There you go. This is so useful. I just have to collect gems. Oh, this is such a good game. Just for this, this is what I can do. Being able to, that's the most satisfying thing about this game, is being able to blitz everything in your way. It's incredibly satisfying. Let's do candles. It's incredibly satisfying just to see, like, you are the, the god and these guys can't even touch you. Like, you're just mowing through them. With zero effort. It's incredibly satisfying. And then you run, then you get tired. Lizard. And then it slows down again. No, it doesn't. Yay. I got mushroom bread. Bread shrooms. Oh, there's two more levels. There's three more, two more levels after this. To get back to where we were, there's four more levels in total, I believe. And if that's the case, then I might just actually cut this off here and do it and finish. You know, my goal is to get to level like 20, the next big boss. I think that should be it. Should be where he is. And if that's the case, I'll get to level 20. And win, because I think this game just does, just does go forever. Like it never stops. Sprint, 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 sprint. I don't, I've mentioned this before, maybe not in this video, maybe in the one of the ones that didn't get recorded, but sometimes when the fireflies die, it sounds like you're slamming a textbook onto them, like one of those big, thick math textbooks. It makes me feel bad every time. Exciting gameplay, activate. I do so much just damage just by touching him, but normal attack, I do decent amount of damage. Blizzard. I'm gonna get past this one to level nine. What's oh, great? Ooh, we're almost like I might actually just go all the way to level ten on this one then, because this is this is level nine right now. This should be able to kill the dragon if I'm if I'm able to level up in this level. level up I should be able to have my full stamina and just blitz the dragon and I'd leave it there if you don't beat the dragon in this amount of time you have like three minutes to beat him 
you have to restart level 9 and go through it again and again until you're able to beat him. It's annoying, I should stop clicking. But Blizzard. I wish Blizzard I wish the Blizzard lasted longer. Is that an upgrade? Flash. Oh, okay, never mind. So causes more damage for the blizzard but it lasts a shorter amount of time. The boss. I'll save my clicks for him. Bye. So my clicks up for him and then then we'll see I, I, but it all hinges on me up uh, not upgrading leveling up this all hinges on me leveling up enough to be to reach level eight and then I'm confident 100% we can we can kill the dragon I just Please, let me level up, please. Almost there. One more dead. I think it's just one more guy. It's not one more guy. Come on. We're almost there. Yes, thank you. Okay. I don't know what they get. Lizard. I don't know what else to get. Each killed. Of course, yeah, that's. It also says bats, but. I haven't really seen any of the bats. You all see them. They're very rare, apparently. Gotta save our, our uh, stamina, our energy. So I can just blitz the dragon. We're almost to the portal, I think. Because the bosses, the, I think the bosses always show up either at halfway or at the end of the... I just get more expensive at each one. This is an endless clicker game. 250,000 black wax. Which means 250,000 candles that you get. Like five or six candles per boss. Extra from the bonuses, which I don't have anymore. Dragon. That's new. This is completely new. I haven't seen that before. But I appreciate it. Altar is looted. Oh, wait, no, because I killed the dragon. Oh, so he stays dead. That's good. Okay. Well, my goal is to get reach level 10, and we can just do this. My goal was to reach level 10. We're at level 11 now. So, I'm gonna leave it here. I'm just gonna let my guy continue to do his thing. After he gets tired, I'll stop and play another game, maybe. If you guys like the video, you already know what to do. Like, subscribe, comment. You know what to do. If you have any recommendations for games, if you have recommendations for other things I should do, or for any ways to improve the channel, let me know. I'll see you guys next time.